right, we're back at Spa in the Group 3s. I am strapped in and I am ready to go. We're away then, the most awkward start in the world. Into the first corner. Nice and smooth on the way out. Five laps in the Group 3 cars, racing hard tyres, one times fuel, one times tyre, and be okay. Only here a couple of weeks back, not last week, week before last was at Spa in the Group 4 cars. Spa's come up quite often in the daily races over the last few weeks. So if you like Spa, there's not much to uh, complain about, is there? A little bit of a lip here as we go through Stavolo, try not to get on that curve, otherwise you can just literally pull your car off the track. The other flags ahead, bit of a crash there, that's going to bump us up into P12. Launch them on now, nice and flat in the Group 3s, lovely. Get on the brakes there for the bus stop chicane, just in between those two metre boards there, the final two metre boards before the chicane. Get yourself round, and on to lap 2. Right, lap 2, onwards and upwards. I quite like Spa myself, so I'm not really too fussed about it coming up again in the daily races this week. But it would have been nice to have had maybe something different, maybe a track that we haven't been to before, or rather a track that I haven't been to before. You know, just spice it up a bit. Get it slowed down at four Lake Coombe. That's nice. Just guide it through here on the way out and then it's on to the apex like that. Can't just take too much. And Maldonado's favourite corner. Looks like it's settled down at the moment, so we'll just have to just keep going for now and see what happens. Let's try and get these curves here if we can. Who remembers some famous guy's dad who crashed at this corner? A bit wide again there at Longing on taking a bit of the track there and then some. Oh, I'll get it slowed down for bus stop. Let's get it turned in there. Right, we're bunched up a bit now as we start the third lap. So let's just see what unfolds here as we come down to the first corner. Just take a more conservative line to there, side by side, that have gone off the track. We'll slip up the inside. Gets into P10 here through Eau Rouge, try not to take too much at the bottom and then again too much at the top. Just follow these two now down the Camel Straight. Just about hitting the rev limit there as we get on the brakes again for the Coombe. Should be moving up another place if we can stay with these guys when the P8 serves their one second time penalty. Nine so having a bit of a bit of a moment there at Maldonado Corner. Trying to keep a tight line through this one, set you up for this one here. Oh, there's one off there. We're going to move up to ninth, and then we're going to move just past the Mercedes here into eighth. Bit of a lift there through Blanchimon just to doubly make sure we get through without reaching those good old track limits. Oh, I've outbreaked myself there for bus stop. Just watch as we rejoin. Oh, we're caught in front of the car behind. Get round the first corner, not causing any problems. Right, I get to work now on trying to get those places back, if we can, that is. Right behind there, going up Eau Rouge. Just going to sort of lift a little bit there just to make sure we get ourselves through. But the Supra there is going to come over at full speed, so just accept it for what it is. They're going up Eau Rouge there, bottled up behind P9. I think we're going to have to get on the defensive here into Le Coombe just to keep the GTR behind us for now. Oh, 
Hill's sort of gone a bit wayward, hasn't it, this race since that bus stop moment. Nismo there going up the inside. It's going to bump us down to P12. I'll break myself on Monday in the Ferrari F40, didn't I? Still a lap and a bit to go. As ever, anything can happen. Always gone a bit there at Stabolo. I've gone a bit as well on that curve. We're going to have to ride it. Ah, oh, get back on. That's going to drop us back to P13. We're <laughs> going backwards here at the minute, aren't we? Time. We've actually got it into the stop. And out the other side again. That's the final lap. Not really placed there for a move at Eau Rouge. Well, nowhere near. Over top of Radion, though, we might be. Let's just see. We're going to have to use sick gear to get over 160. Top of the limits of gear 5. Are we quite alongside until they coom? It looks as though we are. Yeah. Oh, P10 there, signing off as well. That's got us back into P10 now. Clumsy exit there. I think it will help us it. Keep tidy now for the remainder. We should be okay. Should be okay. Oh, back then there is getting a bit twitchy. And again on the exit, just watch those curves as we come out. That's it. Get off the apex and foot to the line. Keep it flat. This one, and you want this one, and you want this one. Not like that. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, oh no! Oh, what was go what was going on there? Yeah, good race. Uh, yeah, just pretend that last bit didn't happen.